could, I thought I'd do a few like short videos because I have a few short videos. So since they're so short, I'll probably put them up at once. So I wanted to tell you a few things here. As you see, there's some some food there. So this here is my newest thing that I love, and I think I did a vlog on it where I was um, I put it in that mini chopper and it. It just was too thick and I was still choking on it. So I'm going to try to, after I put in the mini thing, I'm going to try to do it with a blender too to see. Um, I'm looking into seeing if I could get, there's, um, I wanted that, I forgot what it's called, a Vitamix, is it? I don't know. It's the one Miss Phyllis had, her um, blender, where you could pretty much, I think you could, uh, Blend Up Rocks. It's a very good one. But there's another one I saw. It's called, uh, I think it's a Ninja something. But it's 1200 watt, I believe. So I'm looking into seeing if I could get that. It's this way I could put everything in there, you know, and it would, it's got one of those things that goes all the way up, you know, this, the, um, the thing that mushes it. It's like a blade. Um, so then I'll be able to have more options in eating, but I'm going to try this. This is one of my favorites. Then, to my surprise, the other day, I bought this. I don't know if it's in my grocery haul or not, but, um, I thought, wow, this is already mixed together. I also saw this with, uh, cauliflower, which for now, since I don't have a way to do stuff, that's why this mixer would be really good for me, um, blender, I mean because it would, it would, you know, I could get my own cauliflower and my own everything. But anyhow, this is mashed sweet potatoes and carrots. Oh my gosh. Is this delicious or what? Polly loves it too. So this is it. You just put it in the microwave and look at this. I can eat this. Oh my God. It is so, so good. I mean, Polly and I could probably each eat one of them, but regular prices are a lot. They were on sale for, um, it was $2.99 or $3.99. No, it's it was two ninety nine, so I mean it's a buck fifty each, not bad, but still we could we could eat one each. But we're having this with mashed potatoes tonight. So, um, but if you like if you like mashed sweet potatoes and carrots with brown sugar, which Polly said, hmm, it tastes like there's maple syrup, and he was pretty close. Brown sugar, um, you know, of course the brown sugar I wouldn't choose because if it was plain, I'd eat it plain. But, you know, sometimes you got to take what you got. So, it's, it's, it's good because all I do is put in the microwave and then eat it. It's, it's so good. So, hopefully I'm able to get that, um, that blender. Then I can put my own sweet potatoes and carrots and whatever. And this new yogurt, this is, Polly got me hooked on it. Or it's trying to. <laughs> he, he likes to try all kinds of new things. So, one day he tried this and I'm like, oh no, it's, it's Greek yogurt. It's disgusting. It tastes like throw up. And he just, he's one to try stuff. And he loves, just loves it. So I can eat some of it. Like I'll take a little bit of his. I couldn't eat the whole thing. I'm still not there. But it's, um, it's healthy for you. So, um, again, you know, once I can get some sort of blender that I'll, be able to make shakes. We were making shakes with this with the peach one and peaches. I don't know what else we put in there. Ice and something else. I would assume milk. I can't remember even. These yogurts, um, I think I said it before, but as far as Greek yogurt, this doesn't taste like it. It doesn't taste like throw up. It, it, it's, um, and it's good for you. It's very, very good. Of course, the plain one would be better, but Hey, if this is the only way I can get it in, especially this is good for Polly with his gut problems. And then also we have this <clears throat> sorbet. I thought I got sherbet. We're going to make this drink. We're going to show you. Um, I used to make it on all my kids' birthdays. And any party I had, everyone loved this punch I had. They're like, oh my God, it's out of this world. So I've never made it with sorbet, but I'm sure it'll be fine. So I'm going to do that with in one of my cook with me's. And then there's this. This is Polly Likes, and I get it from sometimes as a treat. And it's on sale always in this one store. They have the cheapest yogurt there. Oh, my gosh. I can't believe this This Oiko is pretty expensive in other stores. Well, a dollar. That is expensive. You can get regular yogurt for how much? I don't even remember. 
49 something like that but um all these actually you can get not not greek but the regular yogurt for 22 cents but lately they don't have it so but anyhow this is this is always on sale at the other store and this is on sale and he likes it he always has me try it try some mom but ugh, i don't like it once we got the cherry and i don't like anything cherry unless they're cherries and well, i can't eat cherries oh it was terrible <laughs> but um every once in a while i'll get him this as a treat because you know he's good stuff he likes this so just wanted to share this if anyone likes this it's really delicious so for now don't forget to subscribe like hit the notification bell share sharing is caring see share all these goodies um don't forget to pay it forward it feels good in your heart polly's heart and mine so for now i'm really happy about this i just wish it came wished already but i'm really happy about this but we're our where we live is a test market, so I'm sure it's going to go away because I like it. <laughs> That's okay. I'll enjoy it while I have it. Bye for now.